I read the holiday season. You know what the holiday season includes? Food. Lots and lots of food. Not just good food, though. <laughs> really bad food. Really bad food. I, I can't argue that. Guys, this is our top ten list of worst holiday foods. <sighs> you ready? Ready. Don't get offended. Let's roll. It's the Olive and Ivory Show. That was awful. Hey, YouTube, I am Olive. And I'm Ivory. Guys, we are on the Ivory set. Again. Yeah, we are. We're on again. We're on this set again. Uh, I hope you enjoyed our latest uh, video, Top 10 Favorite Christmas Movies. Today, we're doing our Top 10 Least Favorite Foods During the Holiday Season. Before they can even get into this, hit that subscribe button, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. Stay up with everything that is all of an ivory. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Reddit, Google+. I feel like I'm... Okay. Fucking out. You like that? No. Guys, we're going to jump right into this. This is our top 10 least favorite food items during the holidays. If you're our families, please take note. Number 10. So I'm going to go with... Stop looking at my list. I can't even see it. Keep in mind that we're both different backgrounds. He's Greek. My family's English. So our foods Galispera. are very, very different as well. Yes. However, this is a Caker Classic canned cranberry jelly. Now. You love canned cranberry. I love canned cranberry jelly. I hate it when it has the cranberries in it. What do you mean, like the whole cranberry? Oh god, it's like somebody skinned every cranberry in the pile and threw the skin into that perfectly good jelly. Like stuck in your throat, meh, meh, meh. and then I feel like a cat ready to puke. I hate that stuff. Canned jiggly jelly, that when you take it out of the can, it doesn't move its shape, it just stands there and wobbles. That's all you need, don't make it fancy, don't put the little things it, in it. Is it like the, the, the can of jellies twerking? Guys, number nine on the list for me is shortbread. Now, I know what you're thinking. Ow! I love shortbread! I associate shortbread with the holiday season! If you enjoy styrofoam, sugary styrofoam, no. it's just, it's dry, it's like burnt toast. Anything that's a vegetable, a vegetable, that's from a can or a frozen bag, I have a major problem with vegetables if they're not fresh. I want to wash the dirt off them myself. Oh. I don't want to smell like that weird canned smell. I just, I hate canned vegetables with a passion and I just full out choose not to eat them at all. Ugh. I think I speak for both of us when I say this one. And sorry, mom, because I think you're the one that ruined this for me. Brussels sprouts. Blah! The English people have this great tradition of boiling Blah! all vegetables until you can drink them through a straw. And although my mom's gotten Blah! so much better with this, just I can't, no matter how hard I try, I they're just, they're ruined. They're vile. Nobody should be eating them. Number six on our list, guys, is yams. Yeah. Um, That's mine too. Sweet, sweet potato. potato. I don't care what you call it. Orange potatoes are wrong. Yeah. When yam fries came out, everybody's like, Oh, can I order some yam fries? Some yam frites? It just no. means they're skinny and there's not much there. Say no to orange potatoes. I hate box stuffing. You should not add water to anything. It's and like watch stovetop it. stuff? Yes, you should not add water to anything and watch it grow and then eat it. Whatever those little green things are and the salt, so much salt. It's like a chia pet. It's Put gross. some water in it and watch it grow. It's so gross. Number four guys is mine and quite frankly, uh, I hate, I hate fruitcake. It is absolutely gross. You know what every kid's dream is? Fruitcake? Hey, no. Daddy, daddy, can I have some cake? Oh. Yes, son and daughter, what kind of cake would you like? Um, I would like you to put fresh fruit in it's my not cake. 
fresh. It's You're right. candied. You're right. I'd like to take some over sugared dehydrated fruit and shove it They're in a cake. They're not dehydrated. I remember when wedding cakes used to all be fruit cake, right? You remember that? Oh, God. That was in like 1920. How about plum pudding? Blah. Bean casserole that has like cereal and marshmallows in it? I don't understand. Let's take a vegetable and mix it with breakfast. And marshmallows. I don't know what drunk ass Christmas hating Grinch came up with that. It's mince meat tarts. They're they're gross. It's breaking my heart. They taste fruit like, cake. No, yeah, well maybe that's why I hate fruit cake. <laughs> and plum pudding. Like something's gone bad, and they put it in a sh in a crusty shell. It's like you serve this. The back of the freezer, you know what I mean? Were vegetables? You know that sauce stuff? Oh, with fruits and it goes to die in the back and, I don't and know they what that scoop is. it all out and, and they put it in the time they, yeah serve this i don't want them to be here anymore serve this maybe we'll get out i don't want you to be here anymore get out guys the number one food we hate during the holidays is fake turkey furky furky tofurky tofurky maybe is that it could be the texture is wrong. It, 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 you know what it tastes? It tastes, it tastes um, like flavored Jello. Like no faux turkey, faux fake toe turkey. Faux no furkey. No fake turkey. No furkey. Guys, that's our top ten list for our most hated foods during the holidays. For our family and friends, do not be offended. Just know that when we come over, do not serve any of this stuff because, quite frankly, we will be offended and leave. Maybe yeah, that's what they want. I love mincemeat. You're eating it on your own. Perfect. Bye, YouTube!